What's up? This is Vincent Bennett from the Acacia Strain. You're watching Hails from the Crypt. Warp Tour Special. I am here on location in Long Island, New York at Jones Beach Theater. My name is Sean, and I am accompanied in this early morning by the most reliable man in metal, Vincent Bennett of the Acacia Strain. What up, Vincent? I don't know if I'm reliable, yeah. but I'm just awake. <laughs> let, me tell, let me tell you how reliable you are. I texted everybody the exact same time right when I got here. The first person to get back to me, Vincent Bennett of the Acacia Strain. The second people to get back to me, Municipal Waste. Their response? We're still wasted from last night. <laughs> Vincent, sober as can be, as always. Much respect, straight edge all the way, 100%. You look good. You lost a ton of weight. You look like a brand new man. What, it, what is it that you're doing, maybe the Liquid Metal listeners, which are maybe on the heftier side to try to get themselves down to Vincent Bennett level? Just don't eat like a trash human. Yeah. That's really what I learned. Uh, if you eat like shit, you'll look like shit. And I still kind of eat like shit, so I still kind of look like <laughs> shit. But... I eat less shit than I used to eat. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's good. Uh, a lot of people like are like, oh, he's vegan now. Oh, he does heroin now. It's like both of those things are false. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just eat better than I used to. I would go with the heroin thing. Be like, you know what? I do, I'm doing a lot of heroin now. I'm straight edge, but I'm also yes. a heroin addict. Yes, the straight edge heroin addict. That's the hashtag right there. If I was, if I was on heroin, I would not be awake at I, this hour. Yeah, whatever the hell time it is. The sun's up, and I feel good about it. I feel good that I'm awake right now, yeah. too. We're here at the Warp Tour. This is How many Warp Tours have Acacia Strain played before? This is our second warp tour. Uh, we did one in 2011, and we thought we were going to get banned forever, and apparently we didn't. Did so you do we... anything that would make you think you'll get banned forever, or just being the Acacia Strain? I don't want to talk about it on the radio. Uh, okay. I don't want to encourage these okay. kinds of activities. Okay. Maybe we'll get banned again. I don't want to get banned again. Yeah, yeah, I got yeah. into a lot of trouble, so I don't want to talk. Uh, just behave. Whose fault was it? Was it yours? 50% uh, mine, 50% the crowd's fault. <laughs> Oh, man, listen, show nothing but love to Vincent Bennett and the Acacia Strain here out of Warp Tour. What have your, some of your favorite Warp Tour experiences been so far besides sitting under this beautiful tent that you uh, keep to yourself on? Today? My whole day uh, is just sitting. So that's my favorite. Like, cool. I like the shade. I like being outside. I'm from the Northeast, so, like, six months out of the year, I can't go outside. Yeah. So, like, I stay outside as much as possible in the summertime, even though it's, like, well, it's beautiful today, but, like, we were in Arizona. It was 120 degrees out. Trash cans were literally melting. Yeah. I was still outside. But that's because in three months, literally three months from now, I will not be able to leave my house. Yeah. So it's like... I'll take what I can get. So your house is where? You said, I saw your tweet, Massachusetts, but not Boston, right? right? I don't live in Massachusetts anymore. Okay. I'm from Massachusetts, from Massachusetts, but as soon as you say, I'm from Massachusetts, people say, oh, you're from Boston. Yeah. Wrong. Now I live in New York, and everyone's like, oh, you live in the city? It's like, no, I don't live in New York City. <laughs> Believe it or not, there's other parts of New York. Yes, yeah. uh, so I live, I live in the capital region. Okay. It's a beautiful place. Nice. New, New York State is one of my favorite places on the planet, so I chose to move. To New York. Badass. Hell yeah, Vincent. We support you in your move to New York. We're here for the Warp Tour, but what it's all about right now is Grave Bloom. New album out now, Rise Records, correct? I'm loving all of the little videos you guys are posting, the quick death videos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yours is the favorite. There's, so so who, who came up with the idea for these? Uh, what is it? What, what are the death videos it's called? It's A Couple Ways to Die. A Couple of Ways to Die, which is, I mean, there's the show 99 Ways to Die or something like that. Yeah, A Thousand Ways a thousand to Die. Ways. We didn't want to get sued. Yes, of course, of course. Well, this is a, a, your own twist on it. I saw the video where you kill your drummer, uh, Kevin. Yeah. Well, actually, where he blows he himself, himself up. Yeah. And then your video, which was definitely my favorite, where you're in your yard and one of my favorite parts very nonchalant part you're rubbing your face in the grass do you have bad allergies uh my allergies are kind of terrible so when i was shooting that video yes. i was very fucked yes. my allergies suck and i'm terrible with grass and with dust and you're rubbing your face in the grass and i'm sitting there and i'm cringing on my couch and i was like i would die and good. in the video you sneeze and i started laughing my balls it was a high pollen day too like <laughs> so i was completely fucked but i did it all for all for entertainment purposes yeah, you know yeah, yeah. Uh, Devin's video should be coming out this week. We're gonna try. We're trying to do one video a week. They're all shot. They just have to get edited. Devin's video is coming this week. Griffin's next week. Tom's week after. So it'll be good. Yeah. So just drop in little gems week yeah, after yeah. week to help promote the new album. Just for fun. Like we used to do shit like that all the time, where we just make fun videos, and we haven't done it in a long time because we all live like kind of far. Yeah. So we're all together now. So we figured we should do like something funny for nice. just people to have fun yeah, with. Yeah, watch. Bring it back the old school feel of Acacia Strain, and I don't want to ruin it for anybody. But uh, Vincent's dog kills him at the end. How is Coco doing? She's great. She's at my mom's house right now. She's yeah. loving it. My mom has a lot of chipmunks in her backyard, and she fucking hates them. Yeah. So 
She's having a great time. You ever bring Coco out on tour? I brought her on Warp Tour 2011 for three weeks, and it's just like it's not a place for a dog. You're in yeah. parking lots, uh -huh. and she likes to be outside a lot, and it's like sometimes it's too hot for a dog, and I don't like to have her cooped up on this bandwagon. So it's yeah. just like, ah, just bring her to my mom. She has a huge backyard and runs around all oh, this gotcha. stuff. Yeah. And any update on uh, Bagels, the dog, that you guys had tour after tour and tour ago? I haven't even thought about bagels for yeah. a long time like we we talked about him yesterday which is weird because when we had him he pissed all over my bed and my pillow yeah. um but yeah i think bagels is doing okay i don't know uh, bagels was a for anybody who's listening who doesn't know bagels was a dog that what you found him out on tour we adopted him some trash couple was trying to sell him for heroin oh, or drug fantastic. money and we just took him uh they're probably dead, but I think Bagels is probably. Well, dead. let's hope Bagels is okay. Let's get into uh, let's get into Bitter Pill, new song off the brand new Acacia Strain album, Grave Bloom. It is out now on Rise Records. We are here for the Warp Tour special.